hello everybody welcome to my channel in today's video we will be making this berry this is reversible berry you can either use the bottom and this is the front you can either flip and use this front and use the bottom for this tutorial you will need 4.5 millimeter crochet hook for size 5 yarn If you have all these materials, then let's get started. To start, we will do a magic ring. And chain 3. 1, 2, and 3. And after, you will do double crochet. 12 double crochet inside the ring. And mark your first double crochet. And once you have 12 double crochet, pull the tail of the yarn and we will slip stitch on this stitch marker. Slip stitch and chain 3. 1, 2, and 3. And we will do 2 double crochet on, the, on this chain. Repeat 2 double crochet or increase on each of the chain for 24 double crochet once you have 24 double crochet we will slip stitch on this stitch marker slip stitch and then chain 3 1 2 3 and we will double crochet in the next two stitches yarn over insert your hook on the first chain pull two loop and pull two loop and we will mark our first stitch and then yarn over insert your hook on the next chain grab the yarn pull two loop and pull two loop and we will do a front post double crochet on under the double crochet here yarn over and we will insert here okay so you will not be mistaken it's right here and we'll do a front post double crochet and we will do the same on the next we will do a double crochet one and then double crochet in the next chain and we will do front post double crochet under here so just repeat this round and we will meet in the end of the round every end of the round you should end with front post double crochet For round 4, we will do a slip stitch in this stitch marker. Insert your hook, grab the yarn, 
and slip stitch and chain three one two three yarn over insert your hook grab the yarn pull two loop and pull two loop that's our first double crochet and we will double crochet in the next chain two and then double crochet on the third chain and do front post double crochet under the third double crochet For round 5 to 11, you just need to repeat this round but you need to increase every round. This is our round 5. We will slip stitch. And then chain 3. 1, 2, 3. And we will double crochet four yarn over search your hook first double crochet and again mark your first stitch double crochet in the next that's two double crochet on the next that's three And double crochet in the fourth chain and do front post double crochet under the fourth double crochet just repeat this round to six seven eight nine ten eleven and just increase every round And this is what it looked like in the round 11. And now for round 12, we will do a slip stitch. Chain three, one, two, three, and we will decrease yarn over, insert your hook, grab the yarn, pull two loop, yarn over, insert your hook in the next chain, grab the yarn, pull through two loop, 
and then yarn over pull all through three loops and that's our de first decrease and we will mark this decrease and we will do a double crochet one double crochet two in the next chain double crochet three in the next double crochet four double crochet five and double crochet six and we will do again a decrease yarn over insert your hook grab the yarn pull through two loop yarn over insert your hook in the next chain grab the yarn pull through two loop and then you have three loop yarn over and pull through three loop and that's the decrease and we will do front post double crochet and all you need to do is you, you just need to repeat from round 13 14 15 and 16 For round 17, we will do a slip stitch, chain 1, and just do single crochet each of the chains. 